I'm Chelsea Reeves, and I'm the Director of Career Services at MTI College. I have three tips that I provide to all of uh, my searching graduates. I call them my goal in three. Um, and when you utilize these three together, that's where you find success. So the first one is to apply to positions that they feel they're really qualified for. Um, and with those applications, writing a unique cover letter to each one. Um, each cover letter will be different and customized to the position. Um, you need to actually tell the employer, verbatim even, that you have the skills and qualifications that they're looking for in a candidate. Um, each cover letter will be sent um, to the employer if you can address it to the employer. That's like brownie points. Um, so that would be the first tip that I can give them. The second one is to follow up with your applications. Employers don't necessarily go after you. You have to go after them. So call them, let them know you're interested and show them those soft skills, those things that, that those intangible things, the follow up, the professionalism, all those things are shown when you follow up in an appropriate manner with your applications. The third tip, and this is one that absolutely cannot be skipped, and that's sending a thank you. So after an interview, even a phone interview, send a thank you to the person who um, interviewed you. Um, write it customized, just like the cover letter. You don't want to send a canned thank you. Be specific to the situation at hand. Um, address it to your interviewer and let them know that you appreciate their time and that you feel you're a great fit for the position. It's like putting that bow on that package. You want them to have the whole package and, and it's you because you're showing them that you have it.